All Eyes on Me. This is a biopic of the life of the rapper, the actor, uh, Tupac Shakur. Uh, for people that had seen Straight Outta Compton, were very excited for this film. I think anyone that was really a big Straight Outta Compton fan of, obviously, the movie, uh, were very excited for the movie because it gave a really cool light to anyone that wasn't, you know, a fan of NWA. It was a really great movie to watch. I think that's what we wanted for for All Eyes On Me about the life of Tupac. I don't think it did that. I think this... I'm not going to explain the plot because the plot is his life. This movie, I can't... It can't even explain... I can't say the names of the actors. I honestly do not know um, who the actors were in this film. They weren't great big actors. I did like the guy that played Tupac. There were a few actors that really didn't work. Um, maybe they would have gotten purely off look. Um, but there were some actors that didn't work, some actors that did work in this movie. But this movie, it was supposed to be a really cool, you know, great showing of the life of Tupac. He is obviously not alive anymore. He's passed away, um, which we see in the movie. That's part of the, the story. And it didn't... I just don't think it hit the hit the notes. Um, this movie was really long. I don't think... It was about two hours, but it felt a lot longer. I was sitting there and I was like, Jesus, this feels like a long time. Like, I was really just never really engaged with this movie. I was like, okay, it's average. I didn't really love it. I felt like... Kind of dropped. I think I had partially high expectations because a lot of people thought this movie was going to be good. Coming straight out of Compton. And it kind of got split because the people that liked Tupac were like, yeah, that was good. And a lot of people that didn't like Tupac were like, that was fucking shit. And then a lot of people that were involved in the life of Tupac or like, you know, know learn about Tupac were really disappointed in this movie. People have called it the worst biopic of all time. People have called, you know, saying it's very infactual things that were just really dumb out of this movie. And I did not know much about Tupac. I really didn't. I can't say I did. But this movie, I just don't think stood out. I don't think I'll ever really want to go back and watch it again. I don't think it makes me want to listen to Tupac music. They didn't do a really good job of incorporating the music into the story, though. Like, he'd tell a story, and then he'd, he'd, you'd see a scene, and the next minute he's, he's writing a song about that music. And it kind of works. Like, oh, so that's where he got that from. That's cool. And that, But that was the, the, thing, the best thing about this movie. I think this movie kind of, you know, especially now that time's passed, been about a month and a half since I made this movie, I just don't have any eager need to want to go back and watch that movie. I haven't got any thought to go back and watch the movie. That's not obviously, not obviously a good sign. I'm going to give this a C-. minus. Uh, again, guys, my videos aren't going to be as long for the next, you know, 10 or so videos just because I'm doing catch-up with reviews as I've been doing fucking all the year. Um, hopefully I can get fully up to date and then be able to do a review the day or the day after I do the review, see the movie and then actually be able to review it. You know, bang. Which I should now because I've got a good setup. Um, I'm using my phone and my camera I don't have a problem. My camera being charged, whatever. My phone's always there. Um, and hopefully I can get the light still going, even though the light's probably not great, but hopefully there'll be more detail and, uh, you know, really great reviews, um, not as rushed, um, but I just want to get them out, because again, I made, a, I made a, a pact to review every movie I've seen this year, and review, and see as much movies as I can, so I go like twice a week, three times a fortnight at least, so, thank you guys for watching, you guys know what to do, I've said it a thousand times, you can like, you can subscribe, and of course have a good one.